What's up everyone? This wasn't a planned video, so it's gonna be pretty short and bare bones. I'm sure you've all heard by now that Britney Spears and Loverboy Sam Ashgari are getting a divorce. I'd hate to say I saw this coming, but I saw this coming. Britney and Sam started dating in 2016 while Britney was still on the control of a conservatorship. For those that don't know, a conservatorship is where a court appoints someone to take care of someone else's personal and financial situation when they're deemed to be unable to do it themselves. In Britney's case, her father was appointed to take care of her affairs. A judge ended that conservatorship on November 12, 2021. Sam Ashgari waited until September of 2021, five years after they started dating to propose to Britney. So it was two months before he knew that her conservatorship was probably gonna end and she would have control of all of her money. When I saw that he proposed to her during this time, my bullshit meter went off. They then married on June 9, 2022. Now you're probably saying, Britney wouldn't have been able to legally marry him anyway even if he proposed to her earlier in the relationship because she wasn't in control of her own life because of the conservatorship. That might be true, but we all know that that logic doesn't work when it comes to showing your love for a woman. It's that whole I'm not hungry so don't order me anything to eat attitude that women have and then when you order food just for yourself they either get pissed off because you didn't think about them or they eat some of your food. So even though technically a proposal wouldn't have resulted in a marriage anyway, you still propose. It's always a test. Well, it gets more interesting because Sam is accusing Britney of cheating on him and that's why he filed for divorce. That reason just seems weird to me. So Britney didn't cheat on you before during the five years you were dating her? If she did, was it okay because you hadn't obtained your goal of getting into a legal contract with her yet? So Britney cheated on you right after you got married when it's supposed to be the happiest time in a woman's life? Why would she cheat on you right after getting married? That doesn't make much sense. Also, from what I understand, the woman hardly leaves her house, so where was she cheating? Do they have a pool boy? Their relationship had supposedly been on the rocks for months. So how does this all come right after you got married? It doesn't make much sense at all. I mean, it's been obvious that she isn't exactly all there and is a little ubots for other Italians out there. And Sam must have known this for a long time. It gets even more interesting because they have a prenup. Before they got married, there were people, including celebrities, all over social media telling her to get a prenup. Sam joked on Instagram about the prenup and said, and I quote, Thank you to everyone who was concerned about the prenup. Of course, we're getting an ironclad prenup to protect my Jeep and shoe collection in case she dumps me one day. Well, the prenup stated that Sam would be entitled to $1 million for every two years that they were married, and it's capped at $10 million for 15 years. Well, now Sam is supposedly threatening to release embarrassing and damaging information about Britney to the public if she doesn't renegotiate the prenup. Britney's still worth an estimated $60 million. If he really made that statement, it's publicly blackmailing her, and I wouldn't be surprised if charges are brought up against him. A couple of days after that came out, a new report from TMZ said that Sam wouldn't be getting anything from the prenup because of it ending from divorce. He also doesn't get spousal support, and there's a confidentiality agreement in the prenup. He does get to keep whatever gifts Britney gave him, including cars. The thing is, TMZ said that their sources said that Britney would still likely write Sam a check because Sam's lawyer filed for divorce and asked for spousal support, which is a challenge to the prenup. There are also other elements of a challenge in the divorce filings having to do with community property that aren't public yet. They said that if the prenup is successfully challenged, the confidentiality clause is not enforceable, which might make Britney not want to challenge Sam's filing, which would make her pay him because she doesn't want him talking about or releasing embarrassing information on her. So if she pays him, the challenge would be withdrawn, I guess. So it's not like Sam is going away quietly, playing it off like he's innocent here and like he was in it for the love. And then Ash Gary has the nerve to post on social media that he wants the media to show kindness and wants privacy in this trying moment. Like he's the one that didn't supposedly leak the threat that he might publicly release embarrassing information on Britney. So you're telling me that these are the actions of an honest man? I smelled the bullshit as soon as they got engaged. He knew exactly what he was doing. He saw a very vulnerable person who had a ton of turmoil around her and he took advantage of her. He saw a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow and now he wants to cash in. All right, so like I said, bad bones, unplanned video. I saw the story and I just wanted to give my unwanted opinion on it. If you want to chime in on this, then leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next regularly scheduled video.